What is up everybody, it's your boy Columbus back at again with another video and in today's video we are going to continue trying to get more castles because last video we got two fiefs. We also got two clans a part of our kingdom. We have... Uh, how do I look at the clans again? It feels like it's been a while. We have, well, two mercenaries which I actually have been helping out with being great great reinforcements and we have the mad kuzites which are made up by our companion shakor the mad with kuzite troops and the shield maidens which should be sturgeon troops i believe um but yeah we have two clans now and we're going to continue trying to take down the kuzites we're going to stay defensive and it looks like the kuzites are also at war with the Aserai and sturgia so they're going through a lot right now and also i see on the map that they have a castle on the other side i believe getting raided by the Aserai. so things are getting interesting the kuzai empire is sure to fall soon and we are going to attempt to to take on this city next um i don't know if we have enough people to do so but it is worth the try in all honesty so let's see what we can do. Let's stop by this village real quick and get some. Oh, oh. Let's help out our homies right here. No, you guys aren't fucking taking out our shield maiden. Fuck out of here. She's over here to help us. Fuckers try to sneak up on her. Oh, look at her troops. They look so sick. Her troops look awesome, man. Hell yeah. Um, but yeah, we're going to try to get some more troops and just a little bit of fodder just so we can see if we can take the city, honestly. Um, because if we get that city, that would be huge. Because not only, I believe, will we, should we get enough influence to maybe bring in another clan for our kingdom from our companions, but <clears throat> that'll help out with cash and stuff too. Please go, uh, to the castle. And that's not something I want to be going through. Um, 510. Okay, let's visit some villages and just beef up what little troops we can. But yeah, we are going to continue uh, taking more and more castles. These Kuzite nomads are going to be no help, but it's whatever. <laughs> There's nobody. Alright, uh, what about this castle right here? We could sandwich the city. We could honestly do that. Let's see if we can. 175? Yeah, let's go for it. Let's go for this castle. Um, the only way they can counter it is if they start raiding the other castle that I just got. Let's do boom. Besiege the castle. I want to see a big party. He's probably going to go counter raid, isn't he? Alright, let's lead an assault then. I don't think... Oh, wait, let's wait for their catapults to be done, and then we'll leave them this all. We should be fine. They only have 175 men. So their defenses won't be the best, and they don't have any catapults. At worst, we just gotta worry about is them shooting bows. Alright, let's auto-deploy, and let's head out, boys. I'm gonna pull out my fucking rifle. I do still want a new rifle. Why are you guys running back already? What is this? What is going on here? Okay, they're manning the catapults. I was about to say, you might, you guys better not be fucking retreating already. That'd be some bullshit right there. Alright, let's take out what soldiers we can. Going to first person. Okay, of course I missed that. I wonder if the catapults that we shoot at the castle, I wonder if they actually kill anybody. See if we need to get a little bit closer. Alright, one militia archer down. <clears throat> Just to relieve the pressure that they're putting on our men. 99 damage. You must got some type of armor on you, brother, to survive a bullet shot. Let's see. Okay, that missed. I hope our men are firing back as well. Let's see. 
Ooh, this better hit. 91 damage. Alright, we're going to get a little bit closer. It won't hurt just to get a little bit closer. Just to make things easier for our men. The less casualties we have, the better. Because we can continue the spree of going after castles. Now, the thing is about this castle is it is heavily... Like, it is farther in Kuzite territory. So there is more of a higher chance that it will get raided. So I am ready for this castle to be taken soon anyways. Um, what the fuck just happened? Oh, what is happening? Oh, my controllers. Okay, that was weird. Turn the game. I don't know what just happened right there. A ghost took over my fucking PC, I guess. Um, let's see if I'm still recording, actually. Okay, good. I'm still recording. I was worried for a second. I thought that was going to fuck up my recording. Um, but, uh... <clears throat> the hope is to get as little as casualties as possible to take this castle and sandwich the city so we can take it and cut off all their, like, you know, uh, reinforcements a little bit. As well as... Um, maybe give this castle to the shield maiden <clears throat> so she can bring her Sturgeon troops up here. I know she's already brought a little bit, but I believe, um, I don't know how it works with castles, but I believe the more castles they have, the more ability they have to bring soldiers around those areas. I took out one spearman. Shit, we already got 80 kills before you even reach the wall. I'm not gonna lie, Kuzites in red look sick as fuck. <laughs> Alright, let me see if I can take out these bowmen. Because they are gonna be annoying. Ooh, I'm getting such I'm becoming such a nice shot with this rifle, man. I love it. Okay, as I miss completely. <clears throat> Look at this bushwhacker. You look so out of place, brother. Alright, another horse archer down. Come on, man. We need you to get up that ladder faster. Oh, can I? Can I? Oh, that was a nice shot right there. <laughs> Oh, we got Batanian soldiers? Who has Batanian soldiers? Is that me who has Batanian soldiers? Or are those the mercenaries? Because it's been a while since we've been in Batania. Alright, let's toggle camera mode, pull out the sword. Notice how we are going up the ladder just a little bit faster than before. I wonder what the reason is, because when uh, we first started off the game, going up the ladder took so, so long. Oh, uh, they're struggling with the fucking shield wall. Let me get in there. Let me push you brothers in there. <clears throat> You're putting up a fight. You're putting up a fight. You're just putting up a shield. You're just blocking with the shield. I forget how to kick. Let me take out these fuckers. Hello, brothers. You're dead. You're dead. Pull out the blicky again. Missed completely. Got a few spearmen waiting just to just get shot in the face. One down. They're trying to run up. Oh shit, they what well, up? Some of them actually came up here. Oh, they're probably from that wall. Alright, he's about to come come to that door. Oh, okay. Oh, any soldiers left? Oh, I missed. Well, thankfully I missed because I probably would have shot uh, one of my guys. This looks so awkward. That looks so terrible. GG's! On to the next castle or city. GG's! We could help. We could get the influence.
I kind of want to take on this, uh, 149 horse archers. We have 96 horse archers. How do I, like, look at them more? I think we can do this. Um, let's wait a little bit. Hold on. Chill, chill, chill. Controller, chill. Let's wait a little bit. Um, let's see if we can recall some of our companions. Because we could use them. Staying at Sana uh, Sanala. I don't know how far away that is. Well, let's wait for our companions to join. Try to get some more fodder. Real quick. Oh shit, we need to take out- yeah, we're gonna have to take out this party sooner or later, because we're running out of influence. We need as much influence as we can. They're running away! It looks like your sins have oh. yet to catch up with you. But they Who are these smaller parties? Oh, that's our men, okay, okay. Okay, I thought these were like, the parties from the, uh, the siege or whatever. You heard me yield or fight. They have more men. Um, they might have the plane advantage. We don't have many companions with us, I believe. I, if any companions with us. Um, so this might be a struggle. But we do have a lot of lords with us. So that's good. We should have... I believe we have Shield Maiden with us. I'm not too sure. Uh, she might have gone on her own. But I do believe we have Calfeath with us. So that's something right there. We got this. I have faith in us. Are we outnumbered? Could we get in, gotten humbled? Possibly. But there's a fucking... Oh my god, water is my best friend. Is that water? If that's water, that's fucking awesome. Because if that is water, then we should be fine. Because that will slow down any of their charge damage. Let's have these men line up. Our cavalry should be goaded. Let's have them charge. Let's have them charge. Them charge. Them charge. Um, what do you have? Increased troop movement speed. Decreased range accuracy penalty. What do I have? Decreased range attack damage. Increased mount movement speed. We are going to put you with them. And I think we're set. That's not water, that's gravel. Okay. We got this, though. We got this, men. Just take out as many men as you can. And we are taking out a lot already. A lot of their level one fucking riders. We are also losing men, which is not good. But is that that is okay? I was expecting that. Because we also have a lot of fodder in our team as well. See a man just prepping to throw a grenade randomly. Get out there, men. I will help you so you can get out there and fight. One of the wolf skin soldiers is down. Our infantry are doing numbers. They're not doing too bad, I guess. Our horse archers are surviving. That's good. Missing my shots. That's not good. Oh, they saved that fucking guy. Alright, one bandit down. Another bandit down. Three more bandits down. Another bandit down. Yeah, all they really got is numbers. This is not the field that I want to fight. Uh, Kuzites, though. This is kind of their advantage. But we also have a miniature horde ourselves with our horse archers. 
We got this. This is this is doable. We got this. Noble Sundown. Come here, fuckers. Oh, nice block. That was a nice fucking block right there. I'm not even gonna lie. I admire that block. We need our foot soldiers to put in work. Have all of our men charge. See, they have 172 men. It is a little bit closer than I want it to be, but I personally think we're doing a good job. Our, our archers are moving in now, so that's good. Oh, I'm hearing explosions. That's not good for them, that's good for us, and I think we're just going to be seeing green from feet here on out. Maybe a little bit of sprinkle of red, but that's about it. Damn, that was a good block right there too. Our infantry are just getting surrounded though. Y'all better not lose the peasants, I mean it looks like we have a little bit of peasants ourselves, but still. We got rock throwers, that's not good. Hop up in this mosh pit, help our boys out. We're definitely not going to be able to besiege a castle for a bit though, so we might disband the army after this battle. We also can help out the Sturgeons, even though I want that city for myself. It'll be nice to have, I guess, an ally hanging out next to us when until they become like an eventual enemy. It'll most likely get rebelled though, uh, due to the fact that it's you know Sturgeon government taking over a Kuzaik uh, castle or city, and then we can take advantage of that ourselves and add another clan into our kingdom. Because I like just paying off the rebel clans. I think the rebel clans are actually amazing. Uh, concept in the game and they make things a lot easier like my first uh, Realm of Thrones playthrough I did I my kingdom consisted mostly of rebel clans GG's man G fucking G's only lost 11 men from my party that's what I'm talking about alright let's go help out our Sturgeon comrades Help them take the city. Okay, we're already in here. I'm not even... Oh, my lord. Okay. Attack! Dodge, man. Dodge. Make sure you do shield wall. Make your shield wall! Looks like they just sent us in. This is a tiny-ass castle. Oh, okay. They're going with their own shield wall as well. Okay. See how much help I can be. I am not trying to risk too much health because we are not getting this castle for ourselves, so I don't necessarily see the point. Oh, they got marauders on this castle? It's so weird seeing Vikings go up against uh Mongols. That's such a clash of cultures. Okay, you guys killed more of your own men than anything with those grenade throws. Damn, he, they keep on tanking the bullets. They're they're getting uh, used to black powder weapons. Oh shit, they just throw throwing axes and grenades. That's actually pretty cool. Come on, Vikings. You guys are taking hella losses. Maybe I should have just let you guys fucking take the L and weaken the castle as much as possible. We could have picked up the scraps. <clears throat> Ooh. Ooh. 
See, I'm trying to find the open. Oh, I see something right there. Just trying to do what I can to take out uh, Kuzites. It seems like the Sturgeons are actually struggling a good amount with Kuzites. Like, Kuzite defense. They're not taking much losses anymore, though, right now. Oh, okay. Yeah, they keep killing themselves. Like, we got 86 kills, but... I feel like most of those were our men. Killing each other. Suicidal Vikings. Very suicidal Vikings. They probably killed some of my men, too, honestly. They got some upgraded warriors up there. It looks like they got some tier 5s up there. You bitch. Fucking head glitching me with a bow. Yeah, they're just shooting each other. I would expect Vikings to do better. Oh my god. They're just barraging. <laughs> they don't fucking care, dude. I'm gonna stay... I'm gonna keep my distance. I'm gonna keep my distance. Oh, I see somebody. They didn't build any like siege equipment either. They were just like, fuck it, we're gonna run up the walls. Very Viking mindset. Oh, they did. Okay, it just got destroyed immediately. Yeah, now that they're on the walls, they should be able to take over. Unless they keep, like, killing each other again. Alright, I want to be on the uh, wall with the Vikings. Oh, now I'm moving up very slow. Just like every single Viking. But I'm moving slower for some reason. I was moving perfectly fine in the last siege. I don't know what's going on now. Come on, brother. We got this. I have a few coming with me. I gotta go up there to help my man. I just got shot in his kidney. Get away from my ladder, bitch. Now that I'm up here, it's over with. I brought some Vikings with me, too. Let's go! Chopping heads, chopping heads. We will extinguish the Kuzites. And then maybe the Vikings next. Because they're fucking stupid. And then maybe, maybe the Empire or Asurai one of those two nuts let's not get too ambitious just yet let's uh you know one step at a time of conquering Calradia hello Viking brothers I'm not Viking but I think Vikings are cool all right let's go down here brother Watch the stairs. Oh, God. Help me watch the stairs. Stop throwing grenades at each other. That's not the Viking way. Push, push, push. Push. Like you're pregnant. You're giving birth. Clean block. Fuck you and your mallet, bitch. No, one of my men died right here. That's not good. Unless that's where my companion passed away. Damn, you're resilient, brother. I don't remember how to kick. I forgot what button it is to kick. Boom. Fuck you and your bows. 
Dude, taking this city is going to make taking over the Kuzites so easy. Because they're just losing castles left and right. So they should be losing money realistically. Meaning their lords and their party should be way smaller than before. But I wouldn't be surprised if they could still pull like armies of a thousand or whatever. Because in my Realm of Thrones playthrough, uh, the Sonori were a small kingdom. But they were still able to pull huge parties out of their ass randomly. Don't run, bitch. I'll open this door. Fuck out of here. Yeah. How do you feel about that? Before you died, you did nothing. You closed the door just for me to open it. Bitch! Open the door again. I'm keeping this door open. Letting the air in. Hopefully this ups our relations with the Vikings a little bit, because I know we're not the most liked people at the moment. GG's brothers, GG's. 173 influence, I will take it. I will take it. I'm getting attacked immediately. Um, but yeah, we're gonna... Ooh, I see somebody that needs help. I will come to save you. Yeah, you don't want that smoke, brother. You don't want that smoke, homie. Stay away from my baby boy. Oh, see, now they're going after you. They want the smoke. They want the smoke. Us and the Vikings are tight. Us and Sturgeon are tight, bro. <laughs> Even though they tried to start war with us earlier, but we're just going to... We're going to forgive them for that. Alright, man. Let's let the uh, Sturgeons handle business. I know that's a scummy way to do things, but... Uh, I'm curious how far they're going to get against the uh, Kuzite charge. We can have our men, like our archers, you know, fire. We don't need any casualties on our side. Plus this also helps me out with tactics, I believe, if I just stand here and do nothing. Our men are missing every single shot. We might have killed some Vikings in the progress. In the process, I mean. Shield Maiden got a kill. Good shit, man. Stay on your ground. Get the fuck out of here. Go fight the Vikings, asshole. Yeah, that's what I fucking thought, pussy. Alright, you know what, man? Just charge. They're being disrespectful. They're still targeting us after we're sitting in the back peacefully and letting them fight the Vikings. Fuck out of here. No way she just died. Oh, okay. I thought Shield Maiden fucking just died on in the battle. I was about to say, there's no fucking way, dude. We're taking a lot of casualties. Like, a lot more casualties than we need. I and mean, we only lost three people from our party, so... It's not much of a loss. Who are they even fight firing at? Oh, okay, the battle's already over. That was a pretty chill battle. <laughs> GG's, I guess. I'll take the 90 influence. Of just watching everything unfold and panicking because I thought Shield Maiden got killed. Can we make it to him? Is he fine? Oh yeah, he's fine. He's okay. He's He's living. He's living his life. Oh no, he's not fine now. Can we make it to him? Can we make it to him? Let's let's do this. Let's do this. I want to jump my people. We're gonna jump you in return. Counter jump, bitch. All right, man. I guess you're all under my command. So let's go up here. Right here. Get that no! uphill advantage. Ah, they're shooting me. They shot me in the ass. Fuck you. Fuck you. We have barrages of arrows and guns, motherfucker. Forward! Forward, soldiers, forward. They're shooting. Hold on. They're shooting cannons at us? Let me go see something real quick. 
That's not loud. Why y'all got cannons? You're Kuzites. You're not supposed to have cannons. <laughs> Distract them while I can. Oh, they have lake rats. Maybe the lake rats have gunpowder weapons? Yeah, they look like they have some, like, uh, mercenary soldiers. So that's probably where they're getting black powder weapons. Because these don't look like Kuzites whatsoever. They are getting decimated. Yeah, those are like rats that have the cannons. Oh, it's nice to know that some uh, mercenaries have gunpowder weapons. Oh my god. I keep on thinking Shield Maiden is dying. It's worrying. It's worrisome. How many more men they have left? 38? That's not shit. That one bandit. He's got this. He's just getting poked in the face with a spear. He just got destroyed. This is so satisfying. We're not constantly stressing out about getting demolished by Kuzites. Oh, that's our soldier. That fucking bum is on our party. I need more clans. I need my companions to hurry up so I can fucking give them their clans. Or else I'm just gonna start another war party and start taking more castles while I can. Cause if I don't, then Sturgeons and Asurai are probably gonna take more. And I don't want, like, the Sturgeons to take more territory, cause I think that's who we're going to be going after next, but I'm not too sure because our relations are so good with them, surprisingly. Peace to you. Uh, we should reward you for your services. Indeed, you have shed blood of you. Deserve a thief, Pandaric Castle. Here you go, brother. Um, I mean, we could just say the bitter drought. The bitter drought. I'm pretty sure I spelt that right. Nope. If I spelt that wrong, they would have bothered me for the entire fucking playthrough. Alright. Now we have the bitter drought a part of the coalition. Let's see where are their clans at. Fiefs or clans. Yes, sir. I like their little sigil as well. Alright, so we have another clan a part of our kingdom. Fucking goaded. And we still have enough influence to where we can raid this city next to us. So we're going to take Calfief, obviously. Zero fucking influence. Um... Take you, you. Let's do all the people nearby. Ooh. Fuck it, let's do everybody. Let's do everybody right now. We're going to take a city. And then we're going to end it off on that episode. Or on that video. Or on that fucking note. <laughs> I don't know how to speak. Ooh. Take the wolf skins. Let's stop by a village. So y'all can get some more people. The Western Empire just took our city. Okay, so let's uh, go look for another castle real quick, I guess. Two more of them. And we're set. Oh, did we crack one of their walls already? Yeah, let's do this. Um, let's see. Let's do... Increase troop melee damage. Against mounted troops, increase charge damage. Increase take at ranged attack damage. Double uh, Let's see. Boom. Increase troop movement speed. 
You can be with them, I guess. All right, let's get this. <clears throat> let's get this show on the road. This will be the last siege of the night. Let's see if we can get a quick thumbnail real quick. Oh yeah, that's gonna be a clean thumbnail right there. All right, man, let's fucking do this. I'm gonna continue my strat of trying to snipe the ones that I can just to help out a little bit. Cause you know every nibble counts. Uh, I don't know how to get off my horse. How the fuck did I get off my horse? Oh yeah, down. Change camera mode. Missed barely. Oh, they're going to have some upgraded troops over here. This is going to be an issue. They're going to be bullet sponges. Just zigzag. Yeah, that's going to be an issue. Ooh, ooh. Let's get behind this rock. Let's get behind this rock. Alright, we should be fine. All right, one raider down. I believe that's like a tier three troop, so that's decent. Militia archer down. Another militia archer down. So that wall is already cleared. They'll probably get some more troops up there soon. Oh damn, this castle is gonna be tough to raid. 19 damage for the fucking gun is crazy. I'm surprised they haven't put up more troops over there on that wall. Where am I getting shot from? I don't see the enemies on this side. I'm not gonna hit old boy right there. Alright, let's start hitting the door real quick just for when the uh, the ram makes it we can we can at least say that we took out a decent amount of damage because this is an awkward castle this is an awkward siege uh, map and even though we do have heavy numbers they have like somewhat of a choke point on us We need our gunmen and our cannons to actually just hit their shots. Is our ram already down? Oh no, it's just going to be taking a long while to get here. Okay. It's going to be a long while before the ram gets here. We're slowly getting kills. I don't think they took out one of our men yet. Every nibble counts. This is one of those sieges where I'm going to have a lot of patience. And I'll take any small victory that I can. We're almost a quarter way through. I believe in us. We got this. We got this. Oh my god, that ram is not even close, bro. This is where we're going to start losing men, though, is that tight little fucking choke point right there. Thank God they don't have black powder. Thank God Akuzas don't have black powder, because if they had cannons, bro... Oh, my lord. We might have already lost this raid. If they had cannons, they could have taken out everybody just with cannons alone on that choke point. We're almost a quarter way. 
which is nice. That's a good head start for the uh, the ram. This is usually better to do with a two-hander, but I usually do two-hander characters. Oh, we took our first loss. But this uh, playthrough, I wanted to try a one-hander, one-handed character slash, you know, archer for the guns. Next playthrough, I am definitely going back to two-handed. I might either do the medieval, high medieval ages, or uh, give Realm of Thrones another shot. If I do Realm of Thrones, I'll probably just do tips and tricks videos. Or tutorial videos since those seems to do like, like a lot of views. Okay, they're close. Get a couple hits in before I get pinned. Okay, okay, don't glitch out on me now. Don't glitch out on me. Pull out the blicky. Oh, damn, what? They're already uh, taking over the wall. Okay, that's good. What the fuck am I doing? Alright. Why can't I shoot my... Oh, I'm reloading. I'm stupid. Come on, man. We got this. Oh, they're running to defend the wall. Let's see if I can get a quick shot in. As they run across the wall. Oh, are well, they not running? Haha, <laughs> I got his ass. Alright, man, let's go. We need to break through the wall. We got this, man. We got this. They just opened it. They were just like, fuck it, let's open this bitch. We're gonna lose anyway, so let's just open it and make it easier for us. <laughs> Bro, what a fucking Judas. Holy shit, okay. I'm gonna have my fun over here. We are, uh, need to reload our weapon already? Yes, we do. Oh, 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 oh. See some archers charging at us. Switch to the sword. This is a huge battle. I hope that I have enough storage for this recording. I should. Oh, I see more men coming this way. Take out those archers, boys. Because they're stupid. They don't start attacking until they're... Okay, don't fucking shoot me. You just almost killed me, dude. Holy shit, man. My men are more of a danger to me than the Kuzites at this point. Which I guess I'm thankful for, but it's also annoying. <laughs> let's go, man. Let's go. I think we might uh, bring Kalfi back to the party after this. Oh damn, they are just punched up. I wanted to shoot them, but that was going to take a long while. I wish I had a hand cannon. If I had a cannon, bro, that would have been so satisfying to kill a majority of them in one shot. They are putting up a fight, I will say that. Where am I in at? I'm like in the same situation I was two episodes ago. Okay, I got out again. That's okay, I'm goaded. I wonder if these are the last men defending the castle. You know what? Notice we never had to take a thief, uh, like a keep recently when we besiege castles. Is that Realm of Thrones feature, or is that like a feature that is rare to get? Because I like taking the keeps; they're pretty cool. <laughs> GG! Another victory for us, and another thief. I am at 19% health because my fucking allies. Mainly because of my allies. I'll take another spear, man. I don't see why not.
Um, let's give it to her. This is Iron Eye. This is not the new chick. Uh, where is she at? Here you go. You can take this. Um, I don't... That's, that doesn't look like a steppy bow. <laughs> it doesn't look like a steppy bow. Um, but we'll give you... What the fuck? Why do you have... Okay, your shit's a little bit glitched. Okay, there we go. It's fixed now. I was going to say, what the fuck is going on here? We will take that experience and we're going to give this to uh, the alone chick. I think. I'm not too sure. Because she is a Kuzite, so we should probably give it to her. Um, I don't know why I would call her clan, though. The lone camels. Maybe. Probably. Are the Ku No, the Kuzites don't use camels. That's Aserai. The Lone Riders. Ooh. Mysterious. Um, I'm fucking corny. We could give it to her after the next battle. So we might just do one more quick battle just to get the influence and give her the castle. Let's disband, disband this army real quick. I do that so many times. Because I want to catch up to this army. Or this little party right here. Yeah, they're fucking attacking our village. Hold on, let's take care of this party first. Send our troops. Bop. 96 influence. Cal Thief, you're welcome. You're my prisoner now, Givard. Giving fucking black powder weapons to Kuzites, what were you thinking? And now we have enough influence. To give our new friend a clan, but before we send her off, let's give her a fucking rifle. And does she have... Yes, black powder ammo. Boom. There you go. You are going to be suited for war right now, ma'am. Um, yeah. She's set for war now. Let's give her the clan. Wait, let's take the, let's vote for the clan for ourselves first. Shakur the Mad, you have two fiefs. You need to calm the fuck down. We're giving it to another one of your friends. Probably an ex of yours, honestly. Uh, let's see. Clan... Sacha the Alone. Talk to. I'm yours to command. I wish to reward you for your services. Uh, Camille Castle. Boom. I don't know what the fuck is going on in the other room. Riders. Uh, the Lone Kuzites. Uh, the Lone Pack, yeah. We're gonna do the Lone Riders. That sounds, that doesn't sound like a Kuzite clan. Uh, the Lone Kuzites. Yeah, let's do the Lone Kuzites. Boom. There you go. The Lone Kuzites have joined the coalition. And now we have, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six. So with that, we are going to end the episode. We have six total fiefs now. We gained two this episode, and we also gained th three clans, the Bitter Drought. Let's see. We have... The Shield Maidens, the Bitter Drought, and the Lone Kuzites, who are now a part of our kingdom, along with our two mercenaries and the Mad Kuzites that we also had. So, things are really looking up for us. The Sturgeons have helped us take uh, territory into Kuzite territory, and the Kuzites are just falling apart. As you can see, three different fiefs are getting attacked right now. So, not only is it just at this moment about trying to get as much fiefs as we can 
but we need to get as much fiefs as we can before the Kuzites are just extinguished and we have to start war with somebody else. Um, we also tried to sway some Kuzite clans to join us from their kingdom. It didn't go too well. Um, understandably so, because we don't have a great reputation right now after chopping off a lot of their heads. But before we do go, I wonder if there are actually any other clans that we can possibly uh, take that don't have any fiefs. Skulder Balda. He doesn't have any fiefs. That's a mercenary company. Okay. Um, let's see. The Jawal. You are... You have no fiefs. Okay, we'll take that. that. I think that's another mercenary clan. You have settlements. You have a settlement. You have a settlement. Settlement. Okay, so they're going to be happy. A lot of empire clans. Oh, God. Okay. <clears throat> okay, we're going to go through all this and see if there's any clans that we can try to sway over to us. We're all Sturgeon clans. <clears throat> the Brotherhood of the Woods is a, started as a Vlandian peasant movement hiding out in the forest robbing from the rich and giving to the poor I want you Ooh. Company of the Golden Boar Let's see. Alright, so I messaged a few clans before we go, and let's see if we have any luck with them. And swaying them into our side. So, uh, I think it was mainly Valandian clans. It's been a while. Uh, I don't remember ever meeting you. I hear you took the forge of the Castle, and without you found some traitor to let you through the gates. You know what's funny? We actually did. Oh, <laughs> that's actually fucking <laughs> hilarious that you brought that up. Um, I'd like you to serve Scars. A mercenary, you don't seem trustworthy. Something like the discuss. Blah, blah, blah. Okay, so he doesn't want to be a mercenary of ours. It's whatever. Um, that's actually very fucking hilarious that you said that because that is so fucking true. <laughs> All right, so we gained two more fiefs today and three more clans, and we are a race against not only the Asurai, but the, I want to say that's the Northern Empire, at trying to extinguish the Kuzites and trying to get as many clans as we can, or many fiefs as we can from the Kuzites, which hopefully we can do that, um, because technically we are still a small kingdom. We only have four fiefs over here. And two on the other side of the fucking map. Um, so our plan is to expand as much as possible. Probably just go after the small castles. We still don't have a city yet, surprisingly. We might be able to go after Orton Guard next. Um, we don't have a lot of influence though, sadly. So we'll figure something out. And after we take out the Kuzites, we might go after... The Asurai, because strategically, it would be hard for them to fight us. Like, it's like one direction up and down. So, that could be the next plan or the next, you know, kingdom to go up against. Either that or else we're going to go up against the, uh, the Sturgeons, which I kind of don't want to do because we would technically sandwich them a little bit, but one side of the sandwich would be a lot weaker than the other. So we'll figure that out. But anyways, if you guys enjoyed the video, please do leave a like and please do subscribe. Um, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.